for Guatemala, it's many of the people in the city doesn't know about the sawfish and all what we have here. You know, it's one of the, the, the far, fastest animals of the sea and how beautiful it is. So for me, you know, knowing about fisheries, knowing about oceanography, knowing about what is happening in my country, it's so special because I want to give them, our people in our country, that kind of knowledge. You know, Guatemala is all about uh, agriculture. But we have two coasts, and the Pacific coast is the biggest one. We have a treasure here, I and mean, we've had the last bucket of, of billfish around the world, and that's the reason we need to preserve it and conserve it. The IDFA Individual Conservation Award is Niels Erickson. Through his efforts and the assistance of other like-minded individuals, the National Commission for the Protection of Billfish was created. The commission brings together government agencies, universities, and the sport fishing community to help ensure fulfillment of existing legal regulations prohibiting the commercial fishing and distribution of selfish in Guatemala. This important commission is now serving as a conservation model for all of Central America. Thank you so much, congratulations. My name is uh, Niels Erickson. I am Guatemalan. I was born and raised here in Guatemala. I have lived all my life enjoying this beautiful country. I uh, am managing partner here at Pacific Fence Resort and Marina. And uh, we've been working uh, the tourist industry of uh, sport fishing here in Guatemala for the last 10 years, and I've enjoyed every bit of it. <laughs> Guatemala enacted into law the conservation of the sailfish in 2002. The law contemplates that the uh, sailfish cannot be caught and commercialized on a national level. Uh, in 2012, we realized there was no entity enforcing the law. So we uh, agreed with the Minister of uh, Fisheries that there was a need for a specific task force to be able to follow through and uh, enforce the law. They all understand that eating uh, sailfish fillet is not uh, healthy and not good for for the population. Our main goal is to be able to create a true tourist industry based on the sport fishing for billfish. By 2020, sport fishing in Guatemala can be one of the top three sources of income for the tourist industry in our country. Well, what makes Guatemala such a special billfish destination is natural topography. We have a very calm Pacific Ocean with a high concentration of oxygen on that upper level, which uh, keeps bait and shellfish closer to the surface and creates just the perfect breeding ground for the ecosystem. Before the Selfish Commission and before Niels, we don't have the right order, we have the laws, but we don't have the, the path to do it the right way. So now we have the support of the private sector, the people that do sport fishing here in our country, outside the country. Now we are working in whole Central America. So now the Commission is this entity that it's working not only for our country, but for the people of Guatemala and showing them that it's it's the whole thing. It's it's not only preservation, conservation. It's it's uh, what what can put outside the world and knowing what Guatemala can uh, put in a map of what the resource we have in front of you. <laughs> <laughs>